What's going on everybody and welcome back to another episode of UHC Minecraft with Shorty Doo-Wop. And as you can see, old Shorty Doo-Wop got a tan. I was looking at my skin the other day and I don't know, for some reason it just looked like sickly, deathly pale. So I decided to give him a little bit of color and I think it turned out alright. Went down to the beach got some sun um, and as you can also see um, I've been doing work in this kitchen um, I kind of was looking at the kitchen and deciding what to do um, and I just thought it looked whack so I was like well I gotta do something with it um, so I took all that stuff down um, the only things I really reused were the furnaces behind us there um, I had to make a few more trap doors but I used some of those and um, yeah I made some bookshelves and stuff and cauldrons used some of the iron I got um, made some buttons and stuff some little feature a little bit of features on there um, but yeah I put some pressure plates on top of here um, put some carpet down on top of that uh, made some carpet for to cover the glowstones over there but yeah, I think I'm just going to keep um, my food over here and stuff. Uh, which reminds me is I just ate my steak. So I need... Well, I have six left. Well, I need to cook some of this stuff. So yeah. So now we got a little bit better of a... Got a fridge. What's up? Keep your hands out of my fridge, kid. Um, so yeah, we got some like shelves and then, you know, some books and stuff. And I put some glowstone up there just because it was looking so dark. So, so yeah. Um, as far as this episode today, I'm thinking. Let's see, we made some changes there. What are the other changes actually? Before I talk about what we're doing, um, I made a different uh, Union flag, um, the UK flag. I made it uh, differently. So I used the thick white borders or thick. Uh, crosses and stuff so the white would stand out a little bit better because uh, the one I did before it was it was using the small one so it didn't have that white outline like the Union flag does um, and the other changes that I made is I took some carpet too and put this out here and just replaced it with the uh, took the gates out and put carpet up here so it would be a little bit easier to get in and out and not have to worry about any of these idiots getting out um, because the chickens especially are kind of they're a pain a little bit so yeah we got these guys in here old lonesome lonesome pigs over here um, I, I, don't, I don't have carrots to breed them so I mean they're pretty much stuck uh, I got my rabbit buddies over here there was one there he is I was going to catch him and try to throw him in there but I kind of, uh, I cut out the back and stuff to get these guys in, so I ain't even playing with it. Yeah, I got our horses there. So, I'm thinking what's going to happen for this episode is I'm going to go mine a little bit more because, um, I want to get to level 30. I need to get some level 30 enchants. Um, I did last time, uh, get some level 30 enchants and got that fortune pick. Um, so efficiency three, fortune two. I'd like to get unbreaking on there, also. But um, but yeah, that's a good a good start. And I really want to get into the mines and try to uh, do a little more strip mining and try to try to get my uh, diamond game on point um, because I need some diamond armor if we're gonna kill this dragon. Um, we're going to need diamond armor, and I'm going to need some good enchants on my picks and stuff to be able to do that. Um, so, part of the episode, I'm not going to make you endure having to watch me um, sit there and strip mine. But we're going to do a little bit um, and just see what we can come up with. And I think halfway through the video, we probably cut and come back over here. And I really need to finish this stuff and get this set up um, for when I do come across some potatoes and carrots and stuff because I also want to do uh, I'm gonna do a little bit of melon on the side 
and then the rest is going to be like carrots and potatoes so we got to work out what to do on that so I'm thinking I don't really know if I because I don't want to use my diamond pick here because that's a fortune pick uh, we want to hang on to that one for when we actually do find diamonds then we could switch to that pick so I don't know if I should make another diamond pick and try to get uh, some unbreaking on it or something or efficiency or because we got 18 you know what let's do it let's just get another pick going because that iron picks gonna it's gonna break pretty quick and I don't want to have to make too many uh, trips back and forth so this can what I do with it am I blind what, what happened did I put it in the oh I put it in here I promise you guys I have not smoked any crack um, so yeah let me uh, just go ahead and clear out my inventory here and get some of this stuff put away because this is amazing no matter how much you try to keep everything kind of um, situated and in the right place it always gets messed up and I also in the before uh, after the last episode ended rather I uh, went running around I went over to where I found the horses and I went over to where I found the horses and the dogs and stuff and I was running around there um, trying to find a zombie villager so I could trap him and um, you know so I could trap him and turn him because now that I had potions I can afford to um, you know throw a potion of, weak uh, potion of weakness on him and then give him a golden apple I've got enough gold for that to be okay and I was gonna do that and I did not see anything um, hardly I mean I saw a few zombies but I've noticed with this um, snapshot okay I'm just gonna throw this crap in here like for God's sakes it's taking too long stone go up here um, what I noticed with this snapshot is that when you are looking like say we've got some zombies on the hillside over here and I see them and I want to check and make sure that there's nothing behind me or whatever I would notice when I would turn around and just make sure nothing's going on and then turn back they would be despawned and they'd be gone so I would essentially just uh, lose them so I think that kind of had that played a part in me not finding any zombie villagers or anything like that but I don't know and I did a bunch of enchants here I did a bunch of level ones and stuff trying to get something good but oh well so I will just take that just in case alright let's see if we can get something efficiency 4 efficiency 3 efficiency 1 you know what let's just go for the 2 so we can get efficiency 3 that's not bad be nice to get some unbreaking sharpness 2 you know what I could get that and just add that on to my sword too okay so put that in there put that in there okay let's head over to the mines and see if we can get anything or let's sleep first how about that so yeah I had a hard time trying to find um, any trying to find any uh, zombie villagers because I'm, I'm afraid that is going to be the only way that I'm going to be able to get the um, get the enchants that I want easily because um, I'd like to get you know get some villagers in here and then we'd be able to uh, get some good tools but 
There's no villagers around, so it's kind of sucks. What's up, buddy? Little bunny foo foo. Hopping through the forest. Well, not hopping. Well, homie was trapped. So, last time I came in here, I didn't have. Let's put that down here. I didn't have that much luck last time. Not as much as I would have liked to have had. Um, I don't know if I'm just at, like, not such a good level or what's going on, but I'm in diamond range and stuff and I found a few I found like one pocket but I figured I would come into I would find a little bit more than I did so I don't know hopefully this time around that I'll have a little bit better of luck in finding stuff so I did a couple here Ooh. Let's see, where are we at now? 195, 11. So we're at 11. I could go up a little bit further. This is the other challenge. I've been fighting this the entire time, too. Um, it just doesn't make it easy. Are you kidding me? What the Okay. So I did bring my fortune pick, right? Okay. What the hell? This whole time, it, see, and now I sound like a, a, a because I've been sitting here complaining about how I wasn't finding anything and now. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's a big one, too. Wow. Okay, let's get that fortune pick out, brah. Let's see. Okay, yeah, we don't have any diamonds on us now. Let's see how much we get here. Holy shit. Just marked it. <laughs> wow. 21. Look out. Yeah, fortune picks is where it's at. And that's why I was sitting there like I would keep, um, when I was sitting down here trying to mine for this stuff, oh my like, god, if I just had a fortune pick, like, this would all be, it wouldn't be such a big deal. Like, I could just come through here and find a couple veins and have so many, you know, so many diamonds, it wouldn't even matter. I could diamond armor out and just enchant all kinds of stuff. Okay, so that's pretty funny. That, that actually helps me out because I was going to sit here and uh, keep recording until I actually came into something. Um, but you know what? I'm going to sit here and I'm going to keep going for a little while and see what else I can come up with. So I'm just going to go ahead and break from here. Hey guys, shorty doo up Just with my iron armor and stuff. You know, it's hard out here for... Uh, it's hard out here for a guy in the Minecraft world trying to make his way. Yeah, right. I'm getting paid, son. Ugh. What's up? Throwing diamonds at you. Yeah. <laughs> so, I found... I didn't find any more, but I did um, set myself up very well. At least better than I was. Um diamond chest plate, diamond helmet, diamond boots. Um, so I used pretty much all the diamonds that I got when I was on camera with you guys. I broke the other pick. That's how I kept going. And I went until that pick broke. And I found like gold and iron and stuff. I pretty much filled up all these furnaces uh, with stuff. Um, so I had a bunch of iron, bunch of gold. Um, my fortune pick these so I come back up and I get this I make this new pick with the diamonds that I got as well booyah got fortune three on this one so I'm thinking I need 
I'm not going to enchant anything. I'm not going to enchant this diamond armor. Plus, I need level 30 enchants on that stuff anyways. But I'm not going to enchant anything so I don't lose this fortune 3. Um, so now we got fortune 3 for the shovel and fortune 3 on the pick. But I'm thinking it's going to be better served on the pick than it is the... Um, than it is on the shovel because the only thing I'm going to be doing with the shovel is gravel, um, flint, you know, and stuff like that, which, you know, it's not really, it's not really worth it in the sense that, um, I'm not going to be using this stuff. That's like, okay, I have everything else I need. I have all the enchants that I want on all my picks and swords and everything. Okay. Now let's put fortune three on the shovel. Um, until that point, I'm not, I'm not going to do all that. So, I don't think I have any more dark oak wood, um, which is what I'm using for a, um, as a barrier on this field. So, I'm going to have to hack into this guy. And I think, I didn't really plan ahead um, as far as what I want to do. Um, with this and how I want to set it up so I'm just kind of winging it so if it looks like crap I may end up changing it I may go back in and have to do something to it but the only thing that I'm really going to do is put dividers in and stuff so it shouldn't be shouldn't be too horrible um, we'll see how see how that does us Okay, so we're going to have carrots, potatoes, and melons. So the melons are probably, I'll use up a small area for the melons. So they need, they have the little sprout thingy that sticks out, and then the melon grows on the next one. So I'm only going to do, man, this is kind of a weird spot because it's going to be doubled up on wood right here. I'm just going to do these two for melons so that'll be melons and then we can just make a big make a big farm for both so how much do we got here um, we got one two three four five six seven eight nine, eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we could just half it, I guess, and just. Oh, is that perfectly enough? Yeah. I'm balling, son. Here, I'm just going to drink a health potion. Whatever. I do work. You need hang on to that. I got diamonds for days. I'm drinking health potions. What's up? I got my diamond dime gear. Say something. Say something. You too. Um, so what we need to do here, um, I only have one bucket. So let's do a infinite spring here. What I like to do with these is um, I'm going to take my shovel and I'm going to get out this level right here. I'm going to get it down. And then I fill that up with water, and then you can kind of see it over here. I use just glass. I was using lily pads. Um, you can do carpet as well. Um, but I'm just going to use glass just because, it, you know, it sticks out and you can see it. I could use dyed glass or whatever, but I'm not really that miffed about it. Um, it doesn't make much of a difference to me because I just, I don't know. It doesn't bug me that much. Um there's a uh, ways you can hide it and stuff with the lily pads and stuff so you can't really see the big glass block right there but it doesn't bug me okay so I think what I'm gonna do is yeah I'm gonna take the shovel and um, we'll try to get that we'll get it one block lower than where it is now and um, fill it all up with water and then um, get our water source blocks up top there so we put that guy there 
um, get our water source blocks. Um, I forget what the range is on it. So maybe if I put one here, it'll get this half of the this half of the farm, and then I put one like right here, and it'll get this half of the farm. But we'll just have to test it out. I put two in here. Um, that one pretty much did most of it, except for a couple one over in that corner. So um, let's just go ahead and get this stuff out of count. I still can't believe I didn't get any more diamonds though. I, mean, I was I was thought I was on going to be on a on a roll. I thought my luck had changed, um, which that was pretty good though to uh, get those. And I'm glad I finally had that fortune pick because that definitely got me more diamonds than I would have had otherwise. I just need to, um, now that, I mean, pretty much the whole game now is going to be, I was kind of hoping that I would find a village to, village to, that I could, um, trade with, uh, find a villager to trade with so I can get eye, uh, ender eyes or whatever, so I can have an unlimited supply of ender eyes that I could throw and try to find the end portal and stuff, um, but I don't think that's really going to work. It's just going to take me uh, pretty much farming Enderman and hoping that I uh, hoping that I can find the end portal pretty quickly without wasting too many Ender eyes. But we'll see. Cause I can't even off the top of my head I can't even remember which one gives you the uh, which one gives you the eye of enders I don't know if it, I can't remember if it's the priest or if it's a librarian that does that because um, we know for the most part that my librarians um, that I have over at that one village they don't have any of that crap so I need to go around this and make it still too because I really there's probably a better way of filling this thing up, but whatever. So I definitely don't want to hear the uh hear the water running. I wonder if I can just do this up here. I need to get more of my buckets. I've got like 15 buckets in here. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go in here and get these bucket, buckets and fill this stuff up. I'm, I probably won't do that on camera because that's like kind of boring, really. I'm going to take these out here and I'm going to go, uh, I'm going to fill them all up and try to get this done. So yeah, let me uh, fill these up and uh, we'll do the finishing touches together. And yeah, I'll come back to you guys. Okay guys, so welcome back. I've got the whole place littered with water. Um, and I am now hoeing the crap out of this place. I'm going ham out here. Um, trying to make sure that everything is getting um, hit by water pretty much. So I don't have any, any places popping back up, um, back into dirt. But yeah, um... I filled this whole thing up with water and I've got these blocks sitting here so I, can, I made some glass um, so I can put the glass up above the water so when I actually do get some crops in here um, they don't fall down into the water um, and so they're not lost forever so there's that there's that there's that and there we go Look at this pecker wood. What are you looking at? Headshot. Um, there's also one more thing before this episode ends that I wanted to show you guys. Um, is that they got a new block in here um, that you're able to actually craft. Um, and it involves gravel. So if you 
take some dirt and bear with me because I've never made it so if you put it into there you go a block pattern like that um, you get uh, I don't think it you were able to see it you get coarse dirt now coarse dirt um, I think you can find it in the one where you get podzol um, but you were never 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 able to craft it um, I don't think you can only collect it so there's regular dirt and then right next to it we got coarse dirt so there's a little bit of a difference um, it's a little bit darker um, but yeah it's really cool just a little bit darker um, you can see that where my cursor is it's just a little bit darker nice little variation if you're doing like an outdoor path or something like that but um, but yeah I just wanted to show you guys that I thought it was pretty neat um, I'm probably gonna plant my melons out here um, and just get them cooking and hopefully we can find some carrots or potatoes at some point in the series um, <laughs> and try to get some of those some of those going um, but sorry I'm burping under my breath here it always seems like when I record I always end up like weird bodily functions like I have to like sneeze fart a snart or I gotta like you know burp or some some uh oh or something crazy um, but yeah I think I'm gonna go ahead and cut this episode off here um, as always thank you guys for watching and um, hopefully we'll see you next time